Hey you guys, Scare9 here, and welcome back to my channel today. The Bungie livestream concerning the brand new changes to the Crucible has just concluded, and as always, I'm here to break down everything for you guys. All of the information that we received is actually going to be split up into two or three different videos. I haven't really decided yet, so make sure you guys are checking back every day to learn about new amazing content coming with the Rise of Iron. In this one, we're going to be talking about how Bungie is finally implementing private matches into Destiny. That is right, all of you guys who have been waiting to play against your friends or just explore the maps in general, you guys are now going to be able to do so when the Rise of Iron launches. So let's go ahead and look at some awesome information about the brand new private match system. So you guys will be able to find the private match node right here on the Crucible activity screen. Once selected, you will be brought to the normal screen you get whenever you select an activity. However, there will be a few new graphic things and options displayed. So first, you can see that you are easily able to switch teams just by clicking the left or right bumpers. Next, you can see in the top left hand corner of the screen, there's actually clan affiliations. From my understanding, this will just display the clan of the person who has started the match, and anyone who is not yet in a clan will be persuaded to go on Bungie.net and join one. And finally, you are able to bring up a whole page of other options just by clicking this button here. On this page, you have an amazing number of features to edit. First, you can choose your game type. This list given seems to include every single game mode in Destiny, including the Inferno variant and the two Mayhem game modes. Then you can choose which map you actually want to play on, and then you are able to set both the time and the score limits for the game mode that you're playing on the said map. Another really amazing feature is that while playing on certain maps like Shores of Time, you can actually choose which time of the day it is while you are playing the Crucible match. This is just a really small but awesome design feature that I'm very grateful that Bungie decided to implement, as it will add some more variety to the games while you're playing them. Next, you can choose whether or not light level advantages are on. And finally, if you're on some of the larger maps, such as First Light, you can choose whether or not you want to have vehicles in the match. So overall, you can see an amazing amount of variety and detail was put into this menu, and this is truly the private match option that we have all been hoping for since the launch of Destiny, and I am definitely excited to see what Bungie can add to it in the future. It will also make for some amazing live streams with you guys. More information on those coming in the very near future. So that is going to be all of the information on private matches for this video. I hope you guys did enjoy, and if you are as excited for private matches as I am, make sure to absolutely smash that like button and to also share this video with your friends and on your social medias. You can click the annotation on screen to learn about the new amazing Destiny collection that is coming out with the Rise of Iron. Finally, subscribe for more awesome Destiny content, and I'll see you guys in my next video.